In a perfect world, students would be in classrooms more, not less. But unfortunately, that is not where we find ourselves today. As we have said all along, our decision to reopen school will rest um, with the science. It will be guided by the science, the counsel of our public health officials, and by the responses that we receive from our families through a robust community engagement process. Over the past month, we have surveyed staff, students and families about how we should reopen schools this fall and what steps needed to be taken in order for them to feel comfortable returning to our schools. A moment ago, we began to inform our families and staff across Chicago Public Schools that we will begin the new school year learning at home and continue learning remotely for the first quarter, which ends on November 6th. The decision to start the school year remotely was not an easy one to make, and we did not make it lightly. As an educator, my desire is to always have students in schools. For many of our students, school is the safest and most stable part of their day. Of course, they depend on us for an education, but many of our students depend on us for so much more. They rely on us for meals, encouragement, and a lot of other things that some people take for granted. To start uh, this school year will certainly look different from anything before. But our commitment to giving our students the most engaging and nurturing learning environment has not wavered and will not. We continue to build out this remote, remote learning platform. We will continue to use data and the feedback from our parents and school leaders who have been instrumental in charting this new path forward. 